Another apparent attempted assassination of the former president. Right now, the FBI believes another person was planning to take a shot at former President Trump. The incident happened on Sunday at Trump's golf club in West Palm Beach. Christian Benavides joins us live now from the scene there. Christian, good morning. What do we know about the suspect right now? Ron and Steph, good morning. Officials say that the suspect was able to get within a few hundred yards of the former president before, secret before a Secret Service agent was able to spawn him. Officials also say that an eyewitness was key in being able to apprehend the suspect so quickly. The FBI says it arrested a man after Secret Service agents saw the muzzle of an AK-47 style rifle pointing toward President Trump through shrubbery while he was golfing Sunday at his golf club in West Palm Beach. Our agents engaged. Uh, we are not sure right now if the individual was able to take a shot at our agents. A witness reported the suspect's license plate numbers to police. Within minutes, the FBI took him into custody without incident in a neighboring county. Officials say the suspect left a rifle, a scope, and two backpacks when he fled. The suspect is identified as 58-year-old Ryan Wesley Ruth, a former North Carolina resident now living in Hawaii. He is seen here in a 2023 interview with the news organization Semaphore discussing the war in Ukraine. CBS News has learned the suspect has a criminal record and had personally been recruiting soldiers to fight in the war against Russia. He reportedly supported Trump in 2016, but at some point switched his allegiance. It was only nine weeks ago that Trump survived another attempt on his life during a rally in Butler, Pennsylvania. The suspect in Sunday's incident now faces federal charges. Florida Governor Ron DeSantis said that the state would conduct its own investigation in addition to the federal approach saying, quote, the people deserve to know the truth about what happened. Guys? All right, thank you so much, Christian Benavides. We're staying on top of this story as new details come to light. Right now, you can get the latest information on our website, khou.com, or on the KHOU11 mobile app. Turning now to